Sam's saying tomorrow. Like six forty-five tomorrow. That was adorable. So, can we just get a round of applause for Sam being adorable? Uh, Fuck you all! All right, so uh, this next poem uh, is actually part three. Sorry. Sorry. So if you have a drink, uh, drink and I drink. That's how you'll be able to follow along, play at home, phone a friend, all that stuff. <laughs> Troparian, the verses. In the darkened church, a baby cried and his screams bounced off the ceiling like colliding protons, exploding in an echo of noise that is both like waves and particles at the same time. An old lady glares at the baby's parents and I want to shout, How do you know he's not praising God? And let everything that has breath praise the Lord. And why don't you stick that lit candle straight up your ass? But I know I don't need to give these people another reason to distrust me. Case. The priest senses the laity, and I'm surprised to find myself thinking that this is God's smell, or his B.O., and what better way to announce your presence than by stinking up the place. The pews are rivers of fire tips, and altar boys are quietly pouring the melting wax on their skins, wa wincing and watching it harden. We were always told never to look directly into the flame. People have passed out before. The hands of children, almost men, are red and encrusted with wax, and I wonder if any of them need a cigarette like I do right now. Amen. The king of all has been crucified, and he raised up Atom from death, trampling down death by death, and upon those in the tombs bestowing life. And that screaming baby broke it down, and all that's left of creation is fission or maybe antimatter or maybe dark energy or quintessence or something that no one has discovered yet. Trisagian, holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. <laughs> I laugh to myself when I check out the girl walking down the aisle, skirt down way over the knee in typical good Christian girl style, sweater, beige, and 100% cotton, the long socks you see on mannequins for the fashionable businesswoman. I imagine her naked and tied to a cross. <laughs> but I don't worry about my immortal soul. Jesus is currently in the process of dying for my sins. Which is fantastic Always. news, because I have a boner on the most solemn of Christian holy days. <laughs> and at least I used to believe in this stuff. I throw a handful of Altoids in my mouth and chew noisily. The old lady turns again and I grin. We left before the priest gave his sermon, and while my parents watched a 2020 special on miracles, I got a ride to the liquor store. Lamentations. Let us behold him who is crucified upon the tree. Whose mother watched as both her son and her God suffered. Death is overcome, sin is overcome, sobriety is overcome, and let us sing, let us shout to all corners of this city, this earth, this universe, that God is dead and death is dead and we are drunk and dreaming somewhere between heaven and hell, and we shall not die, and we shall not die, and we shall not die, and we shall believe in him. Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Praise God! Praise God! Jesus fucking Christ, I bet that hurt. Nails? I mean, come on, nails! Drink, this is my blood which is shed for you and for many. Fucking shit! <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what Je oh, shit. Do you know what Jesus said as he was dying? No one is listening. G-String Divas is on Cinemax. He said, my God, my God, Eloi, Eloi, why have you, you forsaken me, Lama Sabachthani? And if that isn't fucked up, I don't know what is. Again! <laughs> Again! <laughs> Hail Zombie Jesus! Hail Zombie Jesus! Dismissal. I go to sleep thinking of that naked girl on the cross. And that episode of South Park where Cartman gets crucified so Kyle's dad can have an erection. <laughs> Deliver me from pop culture, oh Christ our God. Thank you! <laughs> So Garrett Dixon, what's your guys' name again? One more time. Bakes and Dixon. Bakes and Dixon. Bakes and Dixon. Bakes and Dixon. All right, this is Bakes and Dixon.
and they are gonna make you dance and they are gonna make you shake your ass in your pants and they're gonna do it all night and they're gonna do it right here we go Banks and Dixon now there will be an awkward pause while they continue to set up and wish that I hadn't introduced Sorry. them so early yeah. <laughs> good night <laughs> and stick around after for a final poll by Eddie Habib.